Okay, so yesterday uh, we got our goals uh, showing up as a creator goal when um, when we don't have any yet. <clears throat> so now what we need to do is actually do something here so that we can actually go on and create a goal. So we need to turn this into some sort of button. Um, so let's see what we can do with that. Okay. So this is what we've got at the moment. Um, once we've got our goals, it does a quick load in. Um, it then gets an empty set at the moment because we've got no goals, which means this each doesn't happen um, and it doesn't else. Um, what we need to do instead is just do a quick if statement, I think, around that. So that basically, uh, we always get a create goal and then we'll create a component um, to actually deal with that requirement as such um, because we always want a create goal button at the end anyway so let's do well, we'll just uh, take that up there Stick in goals, and then we'll close off the if. And in theory, that should still work. You shouldn't have any issues. Just to give that a quick test. <clears throat> I'm still using my uh, pretend dev environment here. There it goes, doing the upgrade on the servers. Oh, it took a little bit longer today. It's a bit earlier. Maybe it hasn't had its coffee either. Right, that should... Ah, okay. That's interesting. So it doesn't work quite the way I expected. I thought an empty set would be uh, not... not triggered as a, a valid if statement. So it must be something. Okay, here we go. Oh, by the way, <laughs> I am learning all this stuff as I go along. Um, I'm certainly learning Go. I've hardly touched it. Um, and Svelte, I've only had... Um, a couple of months if that experience with it um, and I don't have a huge amount of experience with JavaScript although I've been doing it for years and years um, it's not been the primary thing I tend to do more back end than front end work so sometimes um, you forget these things as you go along so uh, okay, well, we know that's going to be in a way, so we can just probably do something like that. Can we? Well, I'm not sure, actually. Let's find out. That might actually go bang. Depends. I wonder. Well, you're going to find out too. You probably scream and say, hey, you can't do that. Oh, that's good. Okay. Let's, um, let's just double check there's no warnings on that. It's fine. 
No errors. That's good. Fine. Okay. All right. Well, let's do something with this then. So what we could do um, is create. We could update this. We could have one of these um, where if we don't pass in a goal, um, it could basically style it and put in different data. But what have we got? Here? So we've got oh, yeah, just click. Okay, go. Hmm. It might be a candidate actually. What have we got? Yeah, it gets a bit messy there. What might be better would be to make this into a bit more of a cleaner component. Um, and then pass in this block here as the contents. Uh, as part of a slot, because then we can just use that styling quite nicely um, on any kind of button that goes on the goals. So we could have that as a uh, a goal button or something. Um, we don't need to go super abstract here. We're probably only going to be using this on the goals at the moment, I can think of. Um, so, yeah, let's do that. Let's try. We'll do a copy, paste, I'm going to just call it. In fact, we'll call it a goals item. And then we will basically take out everything from here. Just stick in a slot. Now I'll just call that just for clarity. And I've lost my uh, thing. There we go. That should do it. Now we're gonna okay. <laughs> Did you not want to update that? Where's the roll back on that one? Do, 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 do. Oh, okay. Whatever. <clears throat> okay, so this is going to be basically now removing all of that. Do not need any styling in here anymore. It's now going to. not have a class and it's going to be 
say a goes item. She wouldn't do that. So we have a goals item and we're just going to pass up its on click. It's doing the same thing. It's loading stuff here. Uh, at some point we need to get rid of this bit of error catching stuff here and put in a proper little component, but I'll we'll get to that. So, girls item does nothing, but just has a little bit of styling. Which just happens to be just on that. We'll see. Uh, hmm. Yeah, that's fine, I think. <clears throat> we might have a little problem here because uh, that might not ripple down into the contents. We'll see. Uh, sure. It's fine there. So now we just need to create a a new dummy item. So I've got a goal summary. Gold button seems apt. So I'm going to have a gold item. And again, one click is just going to be forwarded. And what else are we going to do here? So I just need some what we're going to do. I guess what we could do. Well, for the moment, let's just stick in some scaffolding. And we'll just do there we go. Now I think that's gonna be a bit janky there actually. We're not gonna get anything that you would ever want to keep. Um and I think it's probably gonna be the wrong colour. I don't think it's gonna be the white that we might expect. From the uh, girl's item. But we'll see. Yeah, it's not doing what I expected. That's fine. So a quick look at it. Hold on a second. I've not used it. <laughs> no. Okay. Right, I don't even need that else either, do I? Okay. Uh... Okay. Uh, we haven't got... Um... We're not capturing the on-click just yet, but we'll do that in a minute. Right, we just want to use the thing. Hey, hey, hey! I haven't quite had enough coffee yet today. And it's done. That's better. Okay. 
No, it did ripple down. Of course it did. It's not going to ripple up. There we go. So in theory, we should be able to click this and do something. You can imagine once we have goals, they uh, they act as a grid. It's a flex. Um, flex. Uh, yeah, it's flexbox. It's not grid, is it? Yeah, flexbox. Um, it's been a while since I've been working on this. This is why I'm doing this. I'm trying to get back into the rhythm of uh, moving these things forward so I'm, I can learn goal. Uh, goal? Go. Um, and juju and uh, and improve my, my spout skills on the side, doing different things to what I do at the moment um, in my day job. It all feeds into each other. Right, okay, so we need to do something there. Um, we haven't actually got um, a create goal route yet. I do have the beginnings of a form as such to be used um, as the component in a, a edit or add goal. Um, in fact, yeah. Do I want to call it create goal? Good point. No, I don't. I tend to use add edit. Um, yeah. Anyway, let's, um, we've got to improve this anyway. So I'm going to, I'm going to rename that. We'll just call it add. Um, hopefully, uh, yeah, it's just updated the calls. Then, yeah. So what we're going to do here then? Well, I basically want to have something super simple. Don't think. Do we even need text there? What we could do instead is just like a massive plus sign. Hmm. What's uh what's the best way? Hold on, let's think. In the goal summary. At the moment I'm just chucking out some text as a bit of placeholder. Show an account of the measurements that go in the goal. I was going to have more, way more information on it later. So let's, yeah, okay. This is uh, the design and as you go, which is not great. But can I? If I just do. I wonder if I can even just do it. Plus there? No. Can't style that then easily, can I? Can I? I wonder. I do something silly like <laughs> this will be interesting. If I do girls item, will it even? No, it's not going to recognize it. Yeah, I didn't think so. Okay. We're just wrapping a div for the time being. Duh. See what 
I had what that does. Oh, hold on. Maybe that. Uh, let's do. Um, let's do something silly like. Uh, what's the? Now I'm kind of doing. Let me just double check what I've got. Um, Cause item, yeah, I'm doing everything in pixels because I'm keeping it. So this is supposed to be responsive, but I'm keeping all the um, the grid a particular size and then flowing in as as many items as I can. So I'm keeping them. So it's like 300 pixels means it's going to be inside like a, an old school iPhone. Um, it'll be a column, but as you get bigger, it pulls out. So let's do... Yeah, we can just uh, whack in a... <laughs> what if we do 200? That's going to be nuts, isn't it? No, can't do that. Can I? What's that going to look like? That will be silly. But that's never stopped me before. Right, and then I've got... Oh, there I go. Goals. That's all there, isn't it? Okay. Let's see what that does. This could be rather daft. And then we're going to just style it up a bit um, and hook it up to something. Five, four, three, two. Yeah, okay, that's not bad actually. That certainly gets the message across. I can always have a tooltip. Two hundred pixels. I can maybe go bigger. Uh, right. Let's try. Um, I want to leave. Yeah, if I do it to sixty, that leaves forty either side. Side twenty either side for forty total. Okay, we'll do that. Um, and then, right, how do you center things these days in both directions? Let's find out. Um, flex center. What I've got, yeah, try that. Uh, yeah, perfectly centered. Ugh. That's not centered. Right, okay. So we can learn how to do the justify content well writers. Cross axis she's then other property called line items. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, that's easy enough. 
All right, let's try that. So we're just going to do Display flex. Um, which one's the primary there? Here's justify and then align, isn't it? Yeah, so we'll do that. Justify center align items center. See what that does. This little build step might look weird to some people being like, hey, why don't you just use a dev server? But I am making sure that every time I build an upgrade, it does all the work that I want it to do in the charms. So it's pretending to um, bit one. Oh, that didn't work, did it? Okay. Right then. Let's do it. Oh, I see. Okay, it's blown out. Okay, deal it later, just like I did. So that should, yeah, that does that. That doesn't do anything at the moment. Play flex align items. I'm going to have to gen up on that. Because I'm running out of time, I've got stuff to do. Didn't I do this somewhere else? As you can tell, I'm new to flex. If I do that, then I do that. Okay. What we will do. I've already got some stuff doing this. Hmm, okay, that's different. What I could do hmm. if I'm doing that. Yeah, right, okay. What is the time? Okay, well, I've got a, I've got a hard stop in a minute. So I'm going to have to do this properly next time. So um, I will say bye for now and I'll go work out why that didn't do its centering the way it's supposed to. What I'm missing. Maybe um, have a little bit more coffee next time before I start the day. A little bit tired today. Anyway, um, so I will um, say goodbye and uh, speak to you tomorrow.